My name is Caleb Swanepoel. I am a South African and I am a shark attack survivor. I was body surfing my brothers. This was in 2015, 27th of June. I was 20 years old. It was a beautiful day and we were catching big waves. And as I came over the crest of one of the waves I was about to catch, that's when I saw a great white shark on the wave that was busy forming. And next thing I knew, this shark just slammed into me. Um, it felt like a car had hit me. It, something slammed into my right leg. I was pulled under the water. The first thing I thought was, this is a dream. This isn't real. Being a survivor is something that is hard to, it's hard to define. I think it's important to remind yourself as well that you're not a victim. But in saying that, there's so many beautiful things and, and moments and memories and people and adventures that have come through this experience. I never surfed before I lost my leg. I was invited to take part in a surfing event, which I hadn't surfed before. I remember just loving the challenge of being on a board, being on a wave, and, and it, was, it was tough in the beginning. I, I found it very challenging, I was frustrated, but I took it on as a new adventure. And I'm so excited because, you know, I get to go and compete overseas this year. I've been selected for the, for the African team to go and compete at the World Para Surfing Champs in, in California. I never thought I'd have the opportunity to represent my country and to be able to sing our anthem and to be, to be able to wear the green and gold. My name is Tasha Mintasti. I am a professional surf coach which specializes in adaptive surfing or parasurfing as it's now known. Caleb has taught me that with a little bit of planning, some ingenuity, we can do anything that's, that we want to really set our mind to, you know. So yes, he's an inspiration. Caleb is an above knee amputee, which means he's missing his knee joint and his ankle joint and now trying to surf with one leg. Caleb's got a good chance. What's happening with parasurfing at the moment, it's a new sport and Caleb has just changed his category, which is PS stand three, which means he's now only competing against people who are above knee amputees. When you have a disability or, you, or you're differently able, feeling independence is a big thing. It's also made me want to share my story more and, and show people like, look, even if you are differently able, even if you have come through a challenge, you can still push yourself. You can still set goals for yourself. Thank you.